Hi everyone, this is Grace. How are you? You know, we would live up to age 100 and we will be working until age 80. So let's redesign your life. Today, I'd like to talk about skin cosmetics foundation because as we age, it's a personal preference, but I f believe you should still look beautiful, you know. You don't have to look like an old lady with many wrinkles. If you like it, that's fine with me, but I don't want to be like that. I want to stay pretty and uh, I want to have beautiful aging. So I'd like to share with you the foundation that I found. In the past, I've been using MAC, the liquid foundation, but in Japan, the all of the professional you know, makeup artists, especially the art makeup artists for you know magazine and the you know photograph taking, they use this brand. It's by Shiseido Clé de Peau. Clé de Peau. It's a French word. It stands key of skin, I think. Key of skin. And it is by Shiseido, the Japanese cosmetic brand. Why their foundation is so good? Because I think you can feel it. If you use the foundation, like ordinary foundation, you really have to use a lot. For me, this MAC, I need a half pump to cover my face. But this one is amazing. All I need is just a two, two rice grain size, and it, it really smooths out and it covers my skin very well and what i suggest to you is if you go to japan next time stop by their cosmetic counters they are available in any major department stores in japan and uh, they have a little handheld device the sales lady can check the skin color of your cheek and of your neck so that they can match the color uh you know similar to your neck color have you seen those ladies with heavy heavy makeup their face painted like almost white like a kabuki actor but their neck look dark or tanned so you know you don't want to make it like that it's not beautiful you have to have a nice transition or actually you should look the same so that's why I believe they come up with a, such a nice device to check the color of your cheek cheek and your neck. And luckily, when they check my colors, my face and the neck color happen to be almost the same. So they were recommending me either I can go for number 10, which is the lighter fair color, or number 20, which is average. Now, when somebody say you can choose either one, which color should you use? The answer is you should go for the darker color if you have a choice. This is my another girlfriend who used to work for clinic, a counter, cosmetic counter. She told me, if you cannot decide, then go for the darker color because you know better to have a darker color to cover your aging spot fleckles and all other you know, acne scars. Then you can have a powder which is a little bit lighter color and you can put the powder on the T-zone so that it would make your face more three-dimensional. In other words, you don't need to have a bronzer or highlighter, you know? So again, I, I'm so impressed. This Shiseido Cledopo foundation really really work and it is expensive uh, this was about 100 us dollars or let's see 12 12,000 yen it was 12,000 yen plus sales tax but i believe it's worth it and uh, me i don't use foundation too much anyway like now i'm not using it and this mac liquid foundation i opened it last year december 28 and it's still you know two-thirds full so i'm confident this you know she said the clay the pole 
foundation, even though it's pricey, it should last me one year too. Okay, that's all for today. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.